One day, the goddess sang to her lover Bhairava, Beloved and radiant lord of the space before birth, revealer of essence, slayer of the ignorance that binds us, you who in play have created this universe and permeated all forms in it with never-ending truth, I have been wondering. I have been listening to the hymns of creation, enchanted by the verses, yet I am still curious. What is this delight-filled universe into which we find ourselves born? What is this mysterious awareness shimmering everywhere within it? I have been listening to the love songs of form longing for formless. What are these energies undulating through our bodies pulsing us into action and this matter out of which our forms are made what are these dancing particles of condensed radiance what is the power we call life appearing as the play of flesh and breath how may I know this mystery and enter it more deeply my attention is enthralled by a myriad of forms, innumerable individual entities everywhere, flashing into existence and fading away again. Lead me into the wholeness beyond all these parts. Do me a favor, my love. Let me rest in your embrace. Refresh me with the elixir of your wisdom. Ravish me with your truth. Bhairava replies, Beloved, your questions touch the heart of wonder, the path of intimacy with all life, weaving together body and soul, sex and spirit, individuality and universality. This is my cave of secrets. Your inquiry has led you here. I feel your fingers on my pulse. Come with me. Leave behind everything you know. The teachings about me are a light show put on by the celestial musicians, as beautiful and insubstantial as the clouds. Elaborate rituals and garish images may be useful in meditation when your mind is whirling with thoughts of sex money and power, wandering like an elephant in heat. Go ahead and use these tools, yet no, beating drums and blaring trumpets cannot summon the one who is already present. I'm not a collection of incantations, known only to experts. I am not a ladder to be climbed, a sequence for piercing energy centers in your body. I'm not to be found at the end of a long road. I am right here. All the stories about me are like tales you tell naughty children. The goblin is coming to gobble you up, or else soothing fables mothers spin as they hand out sweets. Leave these fantasies behind. Let me tell you of the luminous path. I'm beyond measure. I cannot be calculated. I am beyond space and time. I am beyond ancient and beyond the future. There are no dis directions to me. I am always here. I am the embrace of your most intimate experience. Though I am beyond the intellect, I am not beyond your daring. I'm the nourishing state of fullness that is the essence of soul. You belong to me and I am yours. My nature is spotless, completely uncontaminated. I'm not covered up, not even by a billion galaxies. So who is there to worship and adore? There is no one to appease. Sacred texts sing of my reality, but I cannot be found in them. For I am the one listening, and I'm always closer than breath. 
heat and fire are not two separate things. They're just verbal distinctions. The goddess and the one who holds her are one and the same. We're inseparable. The way to me is through her. I am everywhere infusing everything to find me, become absorbed in intense experience, go all the way, be drenched in the energies of life, enter the world beyond separation. The light of a candle reveals a room, the rays of the sun reveal the world, so does the divine feminine illumine the way to me. She who shines everywhere sings. You who hold the mysteries in your hand of will, knowledge, and action, reveal to me this path of illumined knowing. I long to merge with you, be filled with your nourishing essence. Lead me into joyous union with the life of the universe, that I may know it fully, realize it deeply, and breathe in luminous truth. The one who is intimate to all beings replies, Beloved, your questions require answers that come through direct living experience. The way of experience begins with a breath, such as the breath you're breathing now. Awakening into luminous reality may dawn in the momentary throb between any two breaths. Exhaling, breath is released and flows out. There's a pulse as it turns to flow in. In that turn, you are empty. Enter that emptiness as the source of all life. Inhaling, breath flows in, filling, nourishing. Just as it turns to flow out, there's a flash of pure joy. Life is renewed.